Hello guys, I'm Raphael Marcel and this is a new web series called Unmasked, which is a reality series based on the Masked Ray fashion show which I produced or co-produced uh, along with the help of others um, from FNM, which is a fashion society at our university, which is Stephen F. Austin State University. Alrighty, well, we're about to get started. Um, pretty much what this is, is, as you can see, it's a lot of people here, and some are probably still on their way, but um, with this, uh, we're going to pretty much, I'm going to work with you all uh, individually, and the final cut will be made based on your performance today. So when I walked in, everybody just was looking at me like, who is this girl? So, you know, everybody started walking. It just seemed like the girls was trying to be seen or whatever, which I know that was the, you know, that you were supposed to be seen to get picked or whatever, but shh, I don't know. I don't know why they acted all shy. Like, this is survival of the fittest. I told them. Uh, hey, hey, I just want to reiterate, y'all, that based on your performance tonight, you'll know if you've been selected or not. So standing on the wall is not, excuse me, convincing me any further that you should be selected. So, like, walk your behind off. Like, show this mirror why you should be the one that's selected. So, and I won't say that again. I was nervous, but then when I seen Raphael start yelling, it was like, you know, basically telling us don't get full of ourselves, that we could easily be replaced, we need to work for it. As nervous as I was, I went ahead and I started walking. Okay, hey, with you, you have a nice, clean appearance, but I want to see you loosen up a bit. Loosen up, like when you walk, I want to see you like kind of pick up the pace a little bit. You know, pick up the pace. Everything else is fine, you have a good look, but it's just like, kind of like you're going a little slow. So speed it up just a bit. Okay, I want the walk that you walk, how you walked at the audition. I don't want to steal my little thing. Honey, it's, it's all, I have to see okay. it now. I have to see it now. So when you walk, like, like do, your, okay. do your thing. Like when you walk, the thing is when you walk, I, they, we need to know that it's you walking. When you step out, I need to know that you have a commanding presence over everybody. Okay, I don't know if you all remember Alicia, but she actually came to the first rounds and I, I said no to her. Uh, she came to the second round of auditions and she had spoken with Ashley as to what we were looking for and she came by and did a great job. But there's just, she's not consistent. There's just something that's not there. That extra, is, it's just something it's missing. missing. But it's, that thing is that, that drama. That drama, you give it to us when you first start, but you just kind of lax down. Like when you step out there, full out, every single time, every single time, you, your, your, your body is right, your walk is right, but it's just like, from here on up, I need, I need that to match everything here. You walk out, this is what I'm gonna see. November 12th, if you're selected, when you spin around, what you see is what you get. Music. Ready, go. What about you is special? What are you doing that stands that makes you stand out? It's all about you and what you're doing. Don't let nobody surround you confuse you because at this point you are the only person on the runway. So don't think that because Susan right here is walking fast, I gotta I gotta beat Susan to the end because it's not about her. And I was kind of nervous because, you know, first impressions, it's kind of bad. And I see Kia, she in there in a big old dress and some, some heels and everything. I was like, who is this girl? Why is she all dressed up? So that night we sat down and we chose 14 girls and four guys that we figured would be the best for the show. It was a very, 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 very tough um, time to actually decide on who we wanted to go with. And we actually ended up not choosing one of our veterans who had been in the previous show. So it was very cutthroat, but I, I think we picked the best models for what it was that we were looking for for this particular show. So pretty much this is the first day of rehearsal. Officially you all were selected for the cut. Um, which means we saw something special in you all. So hopefully you all will maintain that level and continue to give us what we're looking for. Um, just to give you all just a precursor, I say this every year. Um, please don't take anything I say or do offensively. You know, it's all in the name of the fashion show. So I may I may not be able to, to pull you to the side and, and baby you and like, okay, honey, everything all right and give everybody two hours of my time at a time. So I may say something, you know, like, you know, okay, fix your leg. And I'm like, I'm sorry, can you fix your leg? You know, you know.
Okay, everybody, you should keep the same distance from each other from the time you start to the time you end. Three, fourth step. I want to see a rotation. So every fourth stride as you walk, I want to see rotation. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And you can spin the opposite way. Let's alternate each time. So one, no, I'll say six. I think a lot of the models don't know exactly what they're signing themselves up for because walking in my show and practicing with me is just like going through boot camp. If I see the smallest error, I'm going to capitalize on it and we can do it time and time and time and time again until you get it right. Don't be afraid to slow it down. Keep in mind, it's easy to do a half turn, stop, then put that leg out and then turn again. So almost like you're walking, walking, walking. Drag that leg and can then step again, okay? So everybody, let, let's, let's see us try that together. Okay, we're going this way. Ready, ready, stand, and go. Right, left, right hand, turn, drag, step. Project Red show and my walk, it wasn't that good, but I got better. Mm -hmm. And yeah, this is just making me a whole lot better. I had a friend of mine that uh, used to go to SFX. She um, she asked me to be in it, and I was like, okay. So I just came to see what it was about, and um, it wound up being a lot of fun. And um, now I'm a part of the organization FNM, mm -hmm. and I'm the uh, secretary. So it's okay. great. I like it a lot. So honestly. This is the best thing that has happened to me since I came to SFA. I love fashion. I love anything to do with fashion. And I, when I, whenever I was at this little swim party, I just seen them modeling. I said, I have to be a part of that. And guess what? I am. So, so I'm happy. So Raphael came up to me and he told me that I was missing some. He told me to walk like a, you know, kind of like a Victoria's Secret model. I'm walking like I'm dead or something. And I kind of, and inside it made me, it made me feel really bad because I felt like I was, I was stepping up. I already had my game. So I just gave it a little bit more. So I was walking down that runway, you know, like a Victoria's Secret model. And hey, I got it. Okay, so at this point, I have to assign models to stylists. And I guess it was super hard because stylists had already made up in their mind exactly what models they thought they were going to get. Now, no offense to my stylist team. I love you guys because I've seen the work that you've done now. But before then, I didn't know exactly what they could do. So I had to team people up with people who I thought could dress nice. Okay, if you haven't noticed, these are your stylists. They have picked two. On the next episode, people need to be dedicated. If you're not dedicated, then I don't know why you came to the tryout. It's horrible about some of the girls' walks. Some of the walks are like, ooh, they can't think anybody else. You know, people are like, I, I just can't do this. I, I can't do this. You're such a stupid drama queen. Put it on, no, no.